I forgot to talk about something in part one: irregular plurals. For example, it's not mouses; it's mice. But why? Well, good news, because in American we don't have irregular plurals. One mouse is moose, and two mouses are mooses. But now, grammar. How old are you? How is that sentence correct? You're not asking how do I do this or how do I do that. So in American, we say what is you age. If you translate this word by word, you get what is your age. Okay, now we're gonna be learning how to count. None is zero. When is one? T is two. Tree is three. Quad is four. Fiv is five. Six is basically the same as English. Six. Sven is seven. Et is eight. Nin is nine. And ten is ten. Eleven is ten when. Twelve is ten to. And so on. Christmas is coming soon, so let's make a word for Christmas. Tristmas is how you say Christmas in American. And snow is snow. Also, look at this sentence. Why is there a comma before the word to? You don't say I'm going to the party to. You say I'm going to the party too. So if this is translated to American, we don't have that comma. This is pronounced me going at the party. Also.